It was once a place for learning. But Piqua police say this old library is now a hotbed of criminal activity. So today, they raided it. Nicole Gregg joins us with what they found inside. Nicole? Jack and Deborah, we were the only ones to talk to the owner of that old library. He tells us he has six rooms that he rents out to people who need a second chance. But police say those people have violent pasts and can bring trouble to the small town. New information tonight on the former Piqua Library at the center of a police raid early this morning where authorities say criminals, drugs, and crime were taking place. Well, you never know when something may happen when you got that kind of activity going on. And I like to see it end. Ron Ruffner has been in Piqua most of his life and says things have changed. And I like to see it end, get back to the way things used to be. <laughs> Tonight, the owner of the old library says he rents out rooms to people looking for a second chance. Because I typically rent to people who nobody else will rent to, who they've had problems in the past and they've gotten better and sometimes they relapse. Police say no one was arrested today but told us they once found a bank robber staying there. It had no real surprise to us. We found heroin, we found cocaine, we found prescription drugs, uh, we found marijuana. Uh, and evidence of it being used there. The old library being shut down tonight as it has been condemned by health officials for numerous violations that include bed bugs, fire hazards, and other violations. Now, the chief tells me he didn't make any arrests today, today because this is just one piece of an ongoing investigation. As for now, the place will stay closed until owners can fix those violations.